the flying croc. Only one level on this, so I think we have time. Let's go ahead and power through Screech's sprint. We'll have a save spot, and then it's kind of the final boss of the main game. see the uh, cannon? That's where we need to get. Oh no, we can't do it alone. I need to throw my little compatriot up there. So we'll go ahead and get that uh, on the uh, when we can start select out if needed. Oh good grief. So this is actually a race. We have to beat this little creature dude. I've already missed my secrets. Gotta get re-familiar with the whole uh, level right quick though. Okay, we can drop down like crazy speed. Follow the bananas. Whoa! It's all pretty, I mean, it's a nice challenge, but there's a challenge spike, oh crap, rats, at the end when there's just kind of like random dragonflies going across. So now I'll show you how you can actually kind of get past that first section really fast and easy. So actually there is a hidden barrel right there. going way too fast because honestly you get a huge lead and I mean I've got it. dead serious. I'm pretty sure we have like plenty of time now because like we're at a super comfortable lead. Like if I just kind of take my time, like not not dawdle, but like not go in hyper speed, I should be fine. Oh, there it is. Literally. I was that close to the end. Ha! <laughs> Good grief. Alright, now we have to actually throw our buddy over those spikes to safety. Otherwise, oh yeah! Whew, okay. Ha! 
hot platforming action. So that's all dead ended across. There's nothing there. There's an O there. Okay. Go ahead and squeak. See, what is this area here? Ah, look at that. We have nothing but time, baby. Nothing but time. That, that should be it here. So that means we missed five bonus rooms in the entire game, I think, about. So that's honestly not too shabby. Not too shabby. So mean. I love the boss fight. Oh, I love the boss battle music on this too. This is such a long boss fight, though, that uh, every every phase you get a free Donkey Kong barrel. I knew I jumped too early. It's up to you, Dixie. You can do it. Girl power. Oh, snap. You can break out of those, but it's actually kind of hard. Just watch for the, oh snap. Watch for the uh, you know skid marks on the ground. I forgot those sections are actually easier with Dixie because you can just float over them. I love this. The uh, when he shoots the uh, cannonball, it gets slower and slower. Crap! 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 Ah! You just have to pick a direction. You commit to a direction. Pick a direction and commit to it. So. Notice how slow it fires at first. Really slow, right? It gets faster and faster. And then I love the very last one that you put in. It like is trolly. So trolly. So if you're so good that you don't need the DK barrel, it actually only stays active until the first cannonball thing. So hopefully I'll get to show that off. It actually breaks. Okay, 
let's not be stupid this time. So see, bam, it breaks the same time you throw the uh, cannon barrel into his gun. controls, I believe. It's actually not reversed. I was pressing down, or pressing left and it was going down. Okay, wait for it, wait for it, wait for it. BAM! <laughs> do it, Diddy, my boy, but how could you fail having learned all you know from old Cranky Kong here? You've rescued that lazy grandson of mine and dumped K. Rule in his own filthy swamp. Not bad for a novice. Of course, if I'd been playing, I'd have made sure that K. Rule never tries a cheap trick like this again. I reckon I'd have found all the creme coins and completed the so-called Lost World. Oh well, can't expect everything from your first game, can we? One more thing, how many of my special video game hero coins did you find? A real player such as myself would have found plenty, I'm sure. I want to pause here. Let's see how well you did then, eh? Alright, so I'm going to pause here for a second, because it's actually pretty cool. The graphics here remind me a lot of the 3D pre-rendered Super Mario RPG sprites, uh, especially the Yoshi. Mario actually does too. So notice I only got 25. Um, had I completed all of the levels, I still could not have gotten all 40, because well, you have to complete the Lost World in order and complete the... You have to beat the game, beat the boss that I just did, and then do more to get the 40th DK coin. So it's impossible to, like, be number one here. However, it's interesting. Had I gotten fewer than... I can't remember. Very, very few. The third place is actually Link. So it's kind of cool to see a 3D model version of Link in this game as well. So in any event... I'll go ahead and uh, unpause. Well, I got a second screen and about time too. Now shut up everyone while I read the eagerly awaited results of my prestigious video game hero awards. Well, at least you're on the podium. Who knows, if you keep on looking, you could be an even bigger hero. Because I'm in third place. He says something else for uh, second place and then... If you want to look at your limited progress on this screen, press the top left and top right buttons while you are on any of the map screens. So that has now been unlocked on the world map. Now buzz off and see if you can find any more of my coins, which I very much doubt you will. Uh, gotta love Cranky Kong, right? Now these credits, one of my favorite credit musics of all time. Listen, enjoy.
yay scurvy Kong crew. So now we're just kind of to the human credits, not that they don't matter, but really awesome game, I love it, but keep in mind that's actually only the first ending to this game. So there is definitely more. So the first thing I think we should do, I'm going to take a quick break here. Uh, might be back a little bit later, but the first thing is going to go through and clean out all of the Krem coins and Donkey Kong coins from all of the normal levels that you already saw me play through. See, in this game, only David Weiss is credited. So it's like, wow, Mr. David Weiss, you are an absolute genius to make so many amazing home run soundtracks in this entire video game. I believe that's Howard Lincoln there, under the special thanks. And Silicon Graphics is the company that like made the 3D models and then created the sprites for Rareware to use. To my knowledge, only the Donkey Kong Country games and Mario RPG did that with making extremely beautiful pre-rendered two-dimensional sprites that very much look three-dimensional. Although granted, it is very taxing because you have to fit everything down into so many pixels and not only that, 16 colors as well. So for some reason, I don't think it soft locks. Yeah, we can at least go back to the home. So let's go ahead and check my clock and stats, and then we'll call it good for a while. So see, not too shabby. Three. Oh, look at that. I've moved into second place. Back to see me again, eh, Sunny? Let's see if you've improved your hero status, shall we? Well, hey, not bad for a youngin. Of course, you're going to have to find a few more if you want to be as big a hero as I was. I actually completely forgot that um, it triggered this automatically. 